Hey, what's going on guys? Thank you again for joining me on my daily vlog. This one's gonna be about food. I know you guys like that. We're heading into Philadelphia. We're gonna hit 76 and uh, we're gonna hit up the Bully, the AKA Roosevelt Boulevard, to go and uh, visit uh, my dear friend Chris Cho, his restaurant Cerebral, right? It's the legendary Cerebral in the neighborhood of Olney. Let's go check it out. Hey, what's going on today, guys? Uh, thank you for joining me on my daily vlog. Today, uh, I'm going to visit uh, one of the best, 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 best places to eat in Philly. Uh, I don't care what type of food, it's just the best spot to eat, all right? It's a spot that's very near and dear to my heart, and it just so happens that a friend owns it, and I can't wait to visit him and then chop it up. I haven't seen him in a long time, but this spot that I'm talking about is called Cerebral, all right? It took me about two years to actually learn how to say the, the name, but I'm glad that uh, I've learned it and I'm glad I've actually known the family here so yeah yo this is my man's right here this is a, a family spot for real man this is the homie this is the bro Chris Cho chef Chris Cho and uh, I can't I'm so excited man I feel like giving him a bigger hug but I'm vlogging right now I haven't seen him in like like months you know but this is the spot that, that I, I'm telling you it's like one of the best spots not just Korean spots but I feel as though it's like the best spot to eat in Philadelphia I'm getting look at the, look at the chef code I'm getting the VIP treatment now Papa Cho, how are you? Nice to meet you. It's Papa Cho right there, you know. Hi, how you doing? It's been a while. It's been a while. This is Clyde. Recording? Right Hello, guys. Hello. 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 Yeah, I'm here at Cerebral. Thank you to my man. Oh, hold on, let me do that right here. But yeah, we're here at Cerebral, man. I'm telling you, this is the best spot to eat in Philly. Not just Korean, but the best spot. I'm just mad excited to see you right now. I know. I haven't me too. Seen you for <laughs> it's been a while, man. I've been like socially admiring Chris yeah. and what he's been doing. So first things first is if you don't know about uh, Korean barbecue or any type of Korean spots, they start you off with some complimentary banchans, which are small appetizer plates, right? You go ahead, you eat it, you want some more, you ask them. But it's on the house, you know, dig in, have a good conversation. We ordered the uh, barbecue, the kaibi. Oh my God, look how beautiful that looks. Kaibi is short rib. And we're going to get down, watch. Uh, Cerebral is something Chris is very proud of. It's an authentic Korean spot keyword is authentic so it's no fusion whatsoever we don't do that fusion over here fam all right it's the stuff that your mom and pops like yes yeah, straight up no fusion over here so don't ask for any type of we ain't gonna do it over here all right straight authentic pancakes authentic bean sprouts authentic chris cho authentic <laughs> but that's definitely not ours that's how you banchan i know you say it with the accent that's why i try to do it too what's it bonchon Got bonchon's chicken. Okay. <laughs> banchan. Okay, so this is banchan. And bonchon is chicken. Chicken. I know that. I know that. <laughs> you read it out. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so it's just like little small dishes. Uh, and I have like my audience really don't know anything about this. Yeah. So these are like little small, I guess complimentary dishes, is mm -hmm. that what you say? Like complimentary dishes that they bring out for you to just appetize on. It happens everywhere at every Korean spot that I've been to. So uh, so for Koreans, like in Philippines, they just have one main dish yeah. and a lot of rice. For us, it's like main dish and a few side dishes, then a rice. So that's a different. It's like if you ever see them like cut through this short rib, a work of art, you know, it's a, a masterpiece the way they do it. It's how you eat, right? You get a piece of lettuce and I'm gonna break this one in half. And, uh, you gotta get the uh, kaibi. I'm gonna get two pieces of kaibi. I'm gonna get some mushroom. You know what I mean? 
I'm gonna get some jalapenos, some raw garlic, whole garlic, all right? What's, what's the exact name for this sauce right here? Samjang. Samjang. Samjang, right? Samjang. Samjang. It's nutty. Very nutty. Dry. It's like very nutty, but it's salty. Soybean. Soy, soybean, that's what it is. <clears throat> With a piece of rice. So that's what you have right there. That's how you eat Korean barbecue with the Koreans, okay? You really don't want to eat too much rice. My first time here, I think I had like three bowls of rice. I had three bowls of rice. Can you believe it? Yeah, I really don't know what it is about this place, but to me, it's it's really magical. It's such a magical experience. Um, the food has so much love in it. The people show so much love. Um, just the whole environment, the whole vibes, the whole aura. All I felt was just love and, and, and the food itself is just fresh, it's tasty, it just feels good. You know, like good old soul food, as you know, like good old Asian soul food, if there's any term for that. Um, and it's very refreshing to eat, you know, it doesn't hold you down. Uh, every bite has a nice crunch, um, very, uh, lots of vegetables, and uh, you know, uh, it's just a beautiful, beautiful environment. I don't, I don't, I'm kind of like, every time I eat this, I'm like speechless, you know? And just having a good conversation with my friend Chris, it makes it even better, you know what I mean? And, and, and I enjoy Korean food, even though I just discovered about Korean barbecue not too long ago. I think the whole culture, um, everything about the food is, is amazing, and I feel as though everyone needs to try Korean food. And look at this. So shout out to Sarah Bo, thank you so much for having me. This is delicious. And I'm ready for bed. Thank you so much. And also, guys, please subscribe to the channel. And uh, yeah, I'll be dropping more vlogs day after day. Like I won't stop. Uh, today's lesson is today's lesson is make sure you make friends with people that have restaurants. <laughs>